Ah, Manhunt Mode, the mode where witch hunting, teaming and high score junkies all come together in an alchemy of chaos. How's this for a high score? And this is only the beginning. And as much fun as it can be, especially with Booster, having all of these high speed car chases and booster chases, reminiscent of the old Diepio days. Ah, the time has gone. But I guess this mode will do, for now. There are some that are borderline, if not incredibly overpowered, thanks to the extra upgrades that you achieve whilst you're the target. Octotank is the main source of this, but I am not here to talk about how overpowered this is. Or am I? I am here to talk about what I consider to be accidental teaming, thus stalling the game. You see this right here, Octotank, Octotank, although one just died, Hexatrapper and Scepter making it incredibly difficult to even try with almost any other tank. You just have to get lucky. Not to mention Octotanks, in particular in this mode, are a pain in the ass to deal with. This all looks like they're teaming, even though they're not. It's even worse when a bunch of Octotanks stay in the middle and essentially make it almost impossible to kill the main Octo Tank. This is what I mean. Accidental teaming. No one can get past other than one particular Ram player who is so desperate to be the one to take it away from them. This isn't good gameplay at all. Let me assure you. When I talk about no-brainer gameplay, this isn't it, Chief. This is just fundamentally broken. And you cannot change my opinion otherwise. And this. This is not how I want to team with my fellow brethren here. This is absurd, and I am a fraud. Accidental teaming makes me a fraud. Yes, please kill me. I deserve it at this point. Imagine being almost indestructible by just staying still. That's the Octotank's dream right here. And it feels incredibly, incredibly cheap. It's simply that easy to dispose of a booster, or any other ram tank. Like, is there any fun when there's no genuine challenge? Maybe it's challenging it for others, who knows. Just end my suffering, please. I no longer want to play with Octotank. Thank you, fellow brethren. It just gets worse, though. You have to have not much of a brain, if any at all, just to completely block the entire area off. I swear a lot of these Octotanks lack any kind of intelligence here, because their greed blinds them. They're essentially acting like the Bent Double's bodyguard, even though they are not. I will do what I do best and eliminate them. This right here is proof that I do not team. Hey, at least this Bent Double actually has some sense. And ending up right here was probably the best thing for them. You just simply cannot win, because as long as there are players who don't know what they're doing, something like this will never change. I don't know why they even bother trying sometimes when the bullets are even stronger when you have extra upgrades. And look at that, this fool can chill, knowing the fact that they have a lot of unexpected and unwarranted protection that they never asked for. Like, how can you do anything to the target when a stupid Octotank is in the way? And I guess that lone player who doesn't care about the target and just wants random score. But these Octotanks are making it far worse than it's supposed to be, so all I can do is take matters into my own hands and eliminate every Octotank there is. Which is just one. And whenever it all breaks free, it happens again, generally because the same player is acting stupid. As usual, they are that greedy. It is much better if you move around the entire maze map and actually show some skill for once, even with Octotank. Even I have done this, and I was always moving. But Brain did a gameplay like this? Never a chance! But I will end this with what I consider to be such a good, very good kill. Because they think we're teaming, and this is undeniable proof that you should not trust anyone. Do not accidentally team. Do not genuinely team. That simple.